Welcome back to the Premier League preview show on City TV. Fun stuff there from the uh, debate segment between Chris and Fenty Tahir. Anyway, uh, let's move it on. Now that we are done jousting and all of that, let's get into the realm of knowledge, of insight, of codes, and how to make more points. This is the FPL Zone on the Premier League preview show. Hi, welcome to the FPL Zone on the Premier League preview show. Last week, we got a confirmation that the man was in the house. If I put that song together. People are wondering who the man was. Last week, I told you who that man was. And that man is back. That man is Daniel Cranting, the oracle, the all-seeing eye, the all-knowing, the master himself. How are you doing? Hi, Nathan. Everything okay? Very, very good. All right. We don't have that much time, but I know that you still have the juice for us. Last week, I was a disobedient child. Mm, mm, mm. I did not listen critically. Mm, 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 and I paid the price. Mm, this mm, mm. week... I will listen. Go so what and have you no got? More, Nathan. Go and sin no more. First player, Marcus <laughs> Rashford. Manchester United, a home game against Brighton. Okay. This is a good opportunity for him. He got a very good goal in the Europa League. And he's been getting at the end of on the end of a lot of chances. You just you just know that once Usually when a player gets into a, into a lot of good positions and a lot of chances, you can just tell that it's just a matter of time before he starts sticking the ball into the, into the back of, of the net more than once. And okay. this is a fine opportunity for him, a home game against Brighton, a team that also plays sort of an uh, expansive football. So the, there will be a lot of spaces left at the back and you expect Marcus Rafford to exploit that. Next player is Danny Ings of Southampton. Okay. They had a very good game at Manchester City last week. Unfortunately, to lose that particular one, um, come back home. The last time they were home, they lost 9 0. It's not going to happen this weekend. <laughs> they are facing Everton. Danny Ings against this Everton defense. Fancy him to get um, some good points there. 45 points so far. That's a very good score, if you ask me, for a player and um, playing for a club like Southampton. A home game against Everton, obviously. Go for him. And he's pretty, he's pretty cheap if you look at his, his, his price tag. You go to the next player in Ashley Barnes, Burnley. For a Ashley second, Barnes. I thought you were going to say Ashley Young. <laughs> <laughs> negative 20. He will never appear on my list. <laughs> he will never ever appear on my list. Next player is Ashley Barnes of Burnley. Um, Burnley have struggled a bit. My home game against um, West Ham, it's a good opportunity for them to get back on track. And Ashley Barnes, obviously, when Burnley are banging it in, Barnes is also banging it in along with them, leading the line there with, um, with Chris Wood, a very, very dangerous pairing, if you ask me. And usually, this season has shown that Barnes is the man getting in the points. 37 points so far, 6.3 million. Sort of a cheaper option also. So yeah, yeah. go for him. And if you have him, just keep him because this could surely be a very good week. Then the next player, Sergio Aguero, away El Kun. at Liverpool. But look, he has a very good... That's why he appears on, on, on the list. He has a very good record against Liverpool. We don't need Manchester City to win. But if they are scoring, it's more than certain that it will be Aguero. He was rested in, in midweek. Obviously, he came on the last five, ten minutes in the game. But it shows the intent from Pep Guardiola. He's certainly going to leave the line against Liverpool and expect him to get a goal or, or two should things go my way. And things usually <laughs> go my way. And then my captain choice for the week, last player, Jamie Vardy. Okay. Yeah, home Vardy. game against Arsenal. Last, last season, if you remember, I predicted this game. Arsenal was certainly going to lose yeah, yeah, no matter what happened. It. It's going to happen again. Arsenal is certainly going to lose this game. And Jamie Vardy is going to... In fact, look, I can tell you here today, Jamie Vardy is going to get the most points in fantasy this weekend. Captain okay. him. All right. That's, that's that. But, Daniel, just, just stay. Uh, let's have a look at the fixtures again uh, for week 12. And then I get some predictions out of Daniel. Now, we'll talk a little roadshow before... So, there we have it. Norwich, Watford, Chelsea, Palace. Let's start off with that. Chelsea, Palace, who's winning that? Chelsea's taking it. Okay. Slim All right. Burnley, West Ham, Newcastle, Southampton, Southampton, Everton. Let's talk about Spurs and Sheffield. Spurs are winning it at home. Okay. Leicester, Arsenal. Leicester City win 3-0. 3-0. Okay. Man United, Brighton. A draw. Oh, interesting. Wolves and Villa. I think Wolves will take it at home. Okay. And the big one, Liverpool, Man City. Manchester City, 3. Liverpool, 1. <laughs> Trust me. Are you serious? I'm telling you. City to win 3-1. I'm telling you. Viewers, I hope you are taking note. Daniel Cranston said that Liverpool would lose that game by 3-1. to one. If it happens, if it happens, I think Daniel would have sealed his reputation as the Oracle. Trust me. I know you have that reputation, but if this happens, Daniel, then you are the greatest. Liverpool 1, Manchester City 3. Wow. That's, that's happening Sunday at Alisa. Let's have a look at, at, at that artwork. Yes, the big one. Alisa Hotel. Sunday... Uh, we start off with Man United, Brighton, and then Liverpool v Manchester City. That's at 4.30 p.m. on Sunday. And that's our Premier League preview show for today. Thank you very much, Daniel. Thanks for the predictions. Thanks for the tips. Earlier, you heard from Fenty Tahir and Chris Nimli with that very feisty 
um, debate and all of that. My name is Nathan Hart. Thank you very much for watching. We'll catch you over the weekend. Enjoy the games. They are live on City 97.3 FM. We'll see you at Alisa Hotel. Join us. Do have a great weekend. Take care and bye-bye.